Hey everyone, it's Monkey1000 and today I had to do a narration. Um, my mic didn't work properly because I had the um, the thing. What do you call it? What do you call it? The patch cord. The patch cord. I had the patch cord backwards. So I'll have to learn how to make sure I don't do that again. Anyways, I got two packages in the mail today. And I'm opening this one up. And I thought it was something else when I opened this up. And it surprised me. So it's a good surprise still. So I'm trying to move that box out of the way for you. And um, I'm trying to open it up. So as soon as I open this up, I'll tell you what it is. There we go. And it is the spice rack. It's made out of metal. And it's the large spice rack from Amazon. And yeah, so I got that today. And I thought I was getting the the silverware um, bamboo um, divider, but it was a spice rack, so that was good. So I'm opening it up, and I'll show you how that goes in the drawer. And uh, it's it's pretty nice. I like it. I think it's going to work pretty good. And we were talking. I don't know what I was saying, but we were talking. And, yeah, there we go. So, I'm going to show you, kind of, bring you around. I'm bringing you around to show you because I'm going to open up the drawer and put it inside the drawer for you so you can see what I'm doing here. And I did have an audience, as you can see. <laughs> She's all excited. She loves the kitchen. So, I'm glad, too. We can all enjoy it. So, I'm opening up the drawer. Now, that drawer it was custom-made for that bar. So, it is bigger than that. But that was the largest one I could get. So, I'm showing you I can move it over to the side. And have some room where I could put maybe something else there. I might, I might do that. Um, I don't know if they make them that size, that small, on the side there. But if they did, i get a little one and maybe something. So we'll figure it out as we go. And I'm, I liked it. It's made out of metal. So it's pretty cool. So now I'm going to open up the next box, which you probably could guess what it is. But, um, yeah, so... As soon as I stop playing with the camera, I'll open it up. There we go. <laughs> so I'm getting it open. And they have these big boxes. They're huge. And then you could see as I pull this thing out. It's not so big. What a waste of boxes. Really. But I guess they want to protect it as much as they can. So I don't have to send it back and be mad. And there you go. So now I'm opening it up. And I pretty much knew what this box was. So I only ordered three things. So it's got to be one of those. Right? So there you go. So there's the glass bottles. There's 24 of them in a box. They give you the labels and they also give you blank labels that you could use the uh, chalk um, pen with. So you can do that. Very nice. And I'm showing you the different kinds of names on the labels. And then they have the blank ones there. And they have some of the black ones that have words on them spices on them too so you could use I guess either or or both whatever you want so 
that will be a, a messy a little messy project but it'll be well worth it so I'm going to take out the bottle for you so you can see they are square bottles and they give you a um, oh I can't think now a spice um, you know funnel so you can put it in I bought one we went to the hardware today and I got me a little one and and they gave me one so I bought a uh, metal one um, and I was going to buy the silicone one but Shea Bear found this one as you see and he th thought that would work better and so now we have two so now we will have my mom help me and we'll both do it together so I will try to do that maybe on the weekend and show you after we get it done and labeled and show you how it, nice it looks so I'm just showing you the bottles in the thing how they're gonna lay so I think it'll be nice. It'll be a lot nicer than having them all scrunched up in a in their cabinet. Um, and it's right beside the stove, so you can put your pick up your spice and throw it in there. And you don't have to be looking and running all over the kitchen for it. So I'm trying to keep things as compact as possible, make life easier as as you can. You know. So. I think I put a few more. The little one on the top, as you can see, those bottles are not going to fit there. So you probably have those little, um, uh, little tiny ones that they have. You could probably just leave them in their jars and put them in there. Um, yeah. But I don't know if all 24 will fit on there. Should. I mean, they give you 24 in the box, but I don't know if they'll fit on that rack all the way. But we'll make it work and I think it'll look nice so yeah I'm pushing it over I think I'll leave it like that as you see so we can put something else there if I have to I can buy like a little container plastic container and put there and maybe put some of the jars or the little tiny ones in there you know so maybe I'll do that we'll figure it out we're still deciding on where we want the uh, utensils for the uh, cooking um, we're going to try to hang them um, but we're debating on that if we want to or not yet and if we do we want to make sure they're nice and pretty so they're not like different colors hanging you know, because that's what you see when you walk in the house you see that kitchen you really see the kitchen more than you see the living room because the living room's on the right so you're kind of looking right straight at the kitchen when you walk in the door. So you want it to look nice as possible. So, there. Yeah, so we'll do that hopefully on Saturday. And we'll, I don't think it'll take that long. But we have a lot of, and maybe some of them might have to be thrown out too. So, But if I buy new spices, then I can put them in there and fill them up. And they're clear so you know how much you got left and how much you need to buy another one. So it's kind of nice, I think. And we're just chit-chatting, I think, about what we're going to do in the kitchen. I did use my sink tonight. I did my dishes and it's a nice sink. Oh, I love it. Yeah, it's deeper than the other one, so it's quite nice. So... I'm just talking about the silverware thing here. I was telling you that it's supposed to come. It should come tomorrow. So hopefully I'll get that. And when I do, I'll get it. I get, I'll do a video on it. And you can watch me put my silverware in there the best I can. And it's an extended one. So I should have plenty of room for it. It should be nice. So... Uh, and we ordered a couple of bar stools today, so when they come in, we'll we'll show them off, so you can see what kind. They're pretty modern. I think they're going to look nice in there, and they look comfortable too. So I think it's going to look really nice once it's all completed. Makes the house look so nicer. So anyway.
anyway, so I'm waving. I'm saying goodbye. <laughs> so Mikey's going to say she's out for now. And stay tuned because I have many more videos. Bye for now, y'all.